Hey everyone, my name is James, and <laughs> welcome back to Antiaris. Uh, basically, since we've been gone, uh, a pirate invasion happened. Uh, well, it started to happen. I logged out, and this this is what happens. <laughs> welcome back. It's day nine. I'm gonna say nine. Maybe it's nine. I'm sure you'll know by looking at the title above. Maybe you'll even know what today's episode's about. Maybe you won't. Uh, but welcome back. Uh, yeah, a pirate invasion happened, and I'm obviously not prepared because I was doing all the mining for today's episode, and I was like, oh, okay, now there's this. Wow, I'm brilliant at building me. Okay, let's see if I can... Let's see if I can... Whoa, there's three of them in here? I was about to say, let's see if I can slay this dude and move onwards. Okay, there we go. I did a bunch of mining for the episode because that was my job. I said I'd do that all off camera. So here we are. We have uh, 84 bars... So let's make a titanium set. Obviously, my character really isn't ready. Look, I'm using a uh, enchanted armor again. So I was thinking about what to make, and I was like, well, you know what? I'm going to go magic because it's what I've already got weapons for. And uh, and I was like, you know what? There are some good things that you can get from the pirate invasion because I, I didn't even I wasn't even sure if I wanted to, to film it. But I remember there is actually some good things that you can get from this invasion. Uh, like for example, like the pirate staff is really good. And, uh, and some other stuff, I guess. A discount card would be great. I'd appreciate that. Alright, let's, uh, actually, let's put this down here. There we go. Nice. Okay. Uh, I can't grab it. It's a little bit out of reach. Okay, there we go. Now let's see how we do. Oh, that is loads better. That is absolutely loads better. I mean, it's not like I could farm away at a pirate. Don't get me wrong. Like, these pirates would still absolutely murder me, but it's not bad. Have I got time to buy potions? Okay, out, out we go. There we go, buff up. <laughs> Alright, this kind of works. This kind of works. Pretty weird way to start an episode, I'm not going to lie. Uh, but I was honestly so unsure about what to even what to even do next in Antiaris, because obviously it's a modded series, so I wanted to continue with uh, all the modded stuff, but I don't know what's next in Antiaris. I guess the requests and uh, and other stuff, but considering we've done the hard, well, the pre-hard mode boss, it, well, the pre-hard mode boss, I wasn't too sure what we could do next. My God, all of my NPCs are now dead, and so are my hopes and dreams. But we have everything in terms of uh, in terms of iron, iron, sure, titanium. That's what I meant. We've got all our titanium, so that's good at least. Let's maybe. Let's maybe leave that situation. That situation was uh, was pretty hectic. Let's be real. So we'll leave that behind. We'll go down to the bottom of the world. And let's, let's have a little think about what we can do. And what we can make. Because I'd really like it if there was some... Some new modded stuff we could be making. So let's have a little look at these, uh, these bars here. Do you make anything new? A Watcher Amulet. Four, 514 summon damage. Are you kidding me? Overworldly amulet. Is this what? Is this the alchemy mod? Oh, it's from the alchemy mod. I don't even know they did a thing like this. Oh, that's pretty strange. Alchemy mod. It's pretty interesting. So you literally can't make anything new. Uh, there are some things with forbidden fragments though that are new. For example, this is new. It's called the Spirit Lamp. It's 136 magical damage. That actually sounds really cool. Desert Spirit Lamp. Now, where do you get one of those? Because I actually have no idea. But that's pretty cool, though. Let's see. Oh, it actually shows you. You get it from the Desert Spirit. Ah. Ah, it's a 1. Point, it's a 1.1 thingy update. 1.3.2, maybe? It's one of them. And then what else is this? You get the Necromancer set as well. Ah, right, because we did get those items that will actually create a sandstorm. So that's what you use it on. Got ya. Got ya. Okay. Well, the only problem is, I don't think... I don't think that I could actually uh, beat one of those little forbidden people. <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't have a clue what they're called. You know, you know what I'm talking about, though. You know one of those enemies that do... Uh, Mad damage, and you get him in the the sun biome during this storm. I don't think I could beat one of them. In all honesty, not right now, because look at the damage I'm doing. It's honestly not that strong. 
of course, I've got a... Actually, you know what? I should be moving... Actually, no, I'll leave it like that. Of course, I've got, like, some stuff to help and that. Don't get me wrong, but... I'm definitely not strong enough yet. Like, I could do with an actual magic weapon that would do something. You know which magic weapon I haven't made in a very, very, very long time? The Crystal Shard. I haven't made that in, like, years. I like the Crystal Shard as well. It's a good little weapon. Okay, let's... You know what I'm doing. I'm thinking, let's kill some, some spitters. Because if we, kill, if we kill some spiders, then we get the chance of getting a, a new summoning weapon. So I might just jump go ahead. I'll start working on the uh, on the summoning weapons and we'll move forward. But I will tell you guys, I am actually a little bit of a loss. Because I have no idea how to structure the next episode. <laughs> and I'll need your help. I'll need some recommendations. But I'm going to carry on with this, and we'll see how far this gets me. Alright, so we've got our summoning weapon, while well, we're about to. And then I'm going to use that against the old pirates, right? So quickly, quickly, quickly make this. Here it is. Spider Staff. Thank you very much, gentlemen. I'll see you later. Okay. So we've got the titanium set on. We've got a magic weapon. And then I'm going to come up here, and I'm going to put this down, get a buff... And then we're going to get rid of some of this stuff in our inventory that we don't necessarily need. And then... Get two spiders on the go. And then we'll use our, uh, our magical weapon. And we'll use some buffs. And then that is my goal. And then this is how we'll make it through this event. And then we can sit and figure out what we're going to do next. Because I can't really do anything until I've done this event. My only problem is, when we get a pirate ship, I'm going to fail. <laughs> Like, for real. Like, I haven't had enough time in uh, in hard mode yet. I'm surprised that it'll even, let it, like, naturally occur, considering that I've not even made hard mode armor. Like, it's pretty surprising. Like, there should be some criteria for it, you know what I mean? Like, it shouldn't be like this. Okay, here's, here's the plan, right? Look at this. I'll use this sword. I also made a titanium helmet, so one that does melee damage. And now look at me. Looking pretty awesome, right? <laughs> I mean, you've got to work with what you get, really. Like, let's be honest, I could just sit here and re repeatedly die using my uh, my little cosmic ray, or I could take actions into my own hands and make this little setup, and this works. This actually does work. Like, let's be real, though, I'm probably not going to beat that Flying Dutchman, but let's see if it can even get me, because that's what I'm interested in. Will it actually attack me while I'm down here? Maybe not. And what's it going to do to this pirate? And the good thing is, look, I can keep my, my little spiders up there doing damage. And then I can uh, just keep attacking with this. It works well. It works well. I'm, uh, I'm proud of myself for this. Look at that. How much health has the pirate got, though? I feel like the pirate's going to be, obviously, like, the hardest thing to kill here. Because it's because it's really, really... Look at that. What's it got? Oh, it's barely doing a scratch. Oh, my God. That pirate's going to live forever, guys. <laughs> Well, I'm going to sit and farm this out. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll, s I'll sit and farm this out. I mean, this isn't the MTRs that we've come to know, but, you know, this is not a bad idea. I could do with a pirate staff. That would, honestly, that would save the day. All right, I'll, uh, I'll sit and chill. I'll let you know afterwards how it, how it went. But uh, I think it's just waiting, basically, until we kill these pirates. Okay, we're coming up to the end now. So it worked pretty well. I literally just stayed inside of my little... Uh, I don't know, a hiding shack. Uh, but this pirate's almost dead. That's the pirate that you saw earlier. I've not killed any more since. But this should be the end of the invasion. Let's see if this works. There we go! Nice. Right, let's kill all the pirates before they steal all me plunder. <laughs> and run away with all me gold. That should be fine, actually. Right, okay, well that's done. And my spiders are working on the... Uh... Whoa! Do you see that lag? Oh my god. That lag was dead bad. Okay, and then my spiders are going to work on this for me. While I'm flying away. Oh, and we got it caught. Nice. Okay, well, we'll leave that doing its job. So we got some good stuff, really. Because all these sell for quite a bit of money. And then I've also got two cutlasses. I've got a, a massive one. And an unpleasant one. So, which one's better? I guess unpleasant is probably better. So we'll swap that out for that. So now I have a full melee setup. I mean, if you swap these over, 
Look at that. Well, that one's... Yeah, that's armoured. So pretty good. Pretty good. And while I'm kind of like letting that kind of destroy itself, I will... I don't know, really. I'm going to... Ah, I guess I chill. I mean, I'm going to sell some stuff. There you go. So you can sell that, sell that, sell that, that, and that. Sell these platforms, even though they don't sell for it. It sells for two silver. Uh, reindeer antlers. Oh, I'm kind of attached to them. But, uh... Yeah, I'll keep them. And then what else? I'll sell this cutlass, because we've already got one. And then I'll keep that there. I'll sell this mushroom. And I've already got these two. So, yeah, looking pretty good. I also got these while I was farming away for the, uh, for the spider fangs. Some stylish scissors. Very nice. I don't think I've ever swung these. Well, now they're sold. So I've only got 39 gold in my bank, but I've now got 57 in my inventory. Okay, how long has this got left on it? Not long. I'll tell you what, I could help it out a little bit, couldn't I? There we go. Go on, Spider, get to work. <laughs> this is good. I feel like uh, I feel like Spider-Man in the comics where he uses his little uh, spider minions or whatever. Nice. Come on, kill it. <laughs> Hurry up. Look how... Uh, come here, let's get the binoculars out. But look how... Look how he's attacking him. He's basically just running on him. <laughs> that's not an attack, man. That's not an attack. I swear that's what it feels like whenever a spider comes into my house. I feel like he's going to murder me by just running over me. Not long left now, guys. <laughs> okay, is it done? And almost. We're down to the final 100. And there you go. <laughs> Sick. I must have got a critical at the end there. Awesome. All right, we'll zoom out. Go down there. Did he drop anything? No. All these little pirates have all scallywagged away. Okay. All right, well, that's done. Well, I have to say, to be honest, guys, you know, as an episode... Which, this is our first episode in hard mode. I mean, we, we went into hard mode yesterday, but this is the... This is the big one. I will say this is the first episode into hard mode. That's probably the weirdest episode I've ever had. And I'm not even joking about that. I don't think I've ever started an episode so unprepared, so unplanned, and made such of a fool of myself because I didn't have the proper equipment. I mean, look. There was a lot to deal with. I'm just sorting out my inventory now so that when we uh, go to craft things in the future, it's all there, right? Or we could put that away. Weapons. Uh, well, we, we probably... Well, we don't need that parrot staff anymore. Actually, what's it do? It does 17 to 28. So, very quickly replaced. So, we'll whack that in there. And then, anything else blocks-wise? Can they go into any of these? Well, I guess that can, that can, and that can. That can, that can go in the bin. Don't need you mushroom. I can't believe I've not replaced that wooden axe. That's so bad. Alright, well, there we go. Well, uh, what do we do now? I, I genuinely don't have a clue. I haven't got a, a sense of direction. We've got a mechanic spawned in. And I've got a giant sword. Should we try and farm a little bit of the sandstorm stuff? But then again... And then again, I'll probably lose. Hmm. Let's see. Well, we got five of these. And five is quite a lot. So I guess it gives us time to, to check it out. But then again, I could really do with my, my potion seller. Because she is a massive, massive help. So I might wait for her. I'll wait for her to spawn in, guys. We'll take a little break. We'll take, we'll take a break. I'll get a bunch of buffs, and we'll give it a go, right? So, I'm trying to get as much done today. You know, I don't want to give you an episode where there's not much in it, because I'm unsure what to do. So, I think that's the next step, is we wait, we get some potions, and we fight it. All right, so I just spent, like, an absolute ton on potions, right? So, I got four of all the good ones, and, uh, and I think I'm ready for this. Although, I'm not exactly sure how well it's going to go. I mean... I'm hoping well, <laughs> right? But I don't know. I feel like, I don't know. I just feel like I'm not strong enough for this yet. But we'll give it a go. I mean, it's always worth trying, isn't it? Uh, let's see, though. Bewitching buff. Left that behind. I just need another 10 minutes of that. So I'll take that. So I've got two of these. And then if I take my summon now, I've got a third one. So that's three spiders. I've got a titanium set. I've got a cutlass. 
and a will to succeed. But I can't remember the name of uh, this thing that pops up. I don't know. I really, I really can't remember. In all honesty, it's been a little while since that update came out. And I don't do this very often. Okay, right. So, sandstorm's happening. It doesn't necessarily mean it will happen straight away, though, does it? It's like, it could be a little bit... Oh, God, these guys are really large doom splicers. Alright, that's dead. Okay, you got desert sharks. So, we got crystal... Hallowed, sorry. Hallowed desert sharks. Whoa, dune splicer, get out the way. Right, we'll know if it comes because there'll be a little, like, sandstormy effect. Well, one that's more than this. Do they get enraged in this mode or something? They're really, really uh, fast. I didn't realize just how fast they were. Oh my god, that death sound though. Was that a robber? Oh, I got a shark fin from it. I didn't even know you could do that. Well, there you go. That's new to me. Alright. Uh, do you know what? It's best just to tank these, considering that they are uh, just giant worms and I've got a, a very fast sword. I literally have everything I have. I've got a. Crit chance up, uh, endurance, defense up, regen, all the good ones. I could really... Oh, there you go. This, this is it. It's happening, guys. It's happening. Okay, what's it called? A sand elemental. Oh, I should have known that. I should have known that. Even though I have a sword, I'm still re resorting back to this just because this seems to work for me. Oh, God. That is a lot of health, man. I don't know how much how much damage I'm ever gonna do to this woman. That is that is a strong boss. Uh, okay. Ah, oh my god! How long can I stay here for? That's the question. Okay. I just need some of those forbidden fragments, please, and then I'll leave you alone. Oh my god! Why does it have so much health? Does that not seem like a hell of a lot to you? It is a lot, isn't it? You see why I was worried about doing this? You know, what, I'm going to take this out because this gastropod's doing my head in. As always, gastropods. I hate gastropods. They're so annoying. Okay. Trying to stay out of the tornadoes. I honestly do not know how I've lived this long during this because I've just basically been like, ah! Oh god, the standing in the middle. Ah! Get out of the. Ah! Uh, <laughs> I like that it just kind of chills because that kind of helps a little bit. I'm not going to lie. Alright. Staying well out of it. Hoping just to regen some health. Okay, die, Dune Splicer. Okay, how much you got left? It's got 3,000. Does it always drop them every time? I kind of hope so at this rate. Because this is taking forever. Oh my god, it's like the pirate ship all over again. Okay, it's getting aggro now. A mechanical worm? Oh, I'll take the free fight. Uh, oh my god. Those things are just... Oh, too hard, man. What a miserable attempt, though. I got potions and everything. Oh, god damn. Uh, I really don't know what to do about that. Maybe you guys can help me out. Maybe you guys can let me know today of some good weapons and stuff. And then I'll, I'll use them tomorrow. But I'm happy with the mechanical worm. The mechanical worm... Absolute, absolute success to me. Because that is actually genuinely a good item. Because it's a free summon, essentially. So you guys can let me know of some good weapons. Maybe you know of some anti-Aris weapons. Some some cheap and easy ones. But do let me know. Uh, but I will end it there, guys. I do want to thank you all for watching. Uh, there was a little bit of a break between the last episode and this one. Uh, I was basically just busy, to be honest. I wish I wasn't, but hey-ho. But uh, I would appreciate some help. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.